Hey guys, so um, I was on Instagram. I'm actually getting ready for my spring gardening and one of you asked to show you guys how I quickly germinate pepper seeds, which are usually kind of hard to germinate. Like they take their time, like really long. So what I like to do is use the paper towel method. There's tons of videos showing how to do it. It's very similar to what I do. It's not really complicated. You get a couple of sheets of paper towel or you can get one sheet of paper towel cut it up in little squares like this and you're going to need like a little sandwich plastic bag like this or a little sandwich baggie that zips all the way shut okay and these are the seeds that I'm gonna use this was some random pepper seeds that fell together in one of my <laughs> ziplock bags and I don't know what exactly the kind of peppers they are and then the other seeds you saw in that paper those are scotch bonnet peppers okay so what you do is you take the paper towel get a plate or you can do it on a kitchen counter but take the paper towel add about a teaspoon of warm close to hot water to the paper towel and then just lay your seeds onto the paper towel then you're gonna have to fold it over okay I do suggest spacing out your seeds because um, last year when I did this, I was kind of rushing and I kind of just threw the seeds together. And when they started to germinate and sprout and get roots and stuff, they started to tangle into each other, which made it kind of hard to separate them. Okay. So once you have your seeds on your paper towel, fold it over. You can just leave it like this, but I like to fold it over again and kind of like envelope it, encase it into the paper towel. So this way they don't slip out, you know, just keep them in there then you're gonna put it into your little sandwich baggie um, you don't have to blow any air into it there's enough air in there to let these seeds process and germinate okay and you're gonna want to close this all the way don't leave anything open um, you can label your baggies so you don't get confused Okay, I don't know why I wrote scotch, scotch, scotch bond, but I put scotch bond so I know exactly what kind of seed it is. The other one, um, I actually put a question mark and pepper on it because I had no idea what kind of peppers those were. Like, I think it's a mixture of three peppers, but we're going to have to see when they finally grow what exactly they are. So here again, you wet your paper towel. And you don't need fancy paper towel. This paper towel was a dollar from Dollar General. And you fold it over. I like to encase it and fold it over like an envelope, like I said before. You put it in your sandwich baggie. You don't have to put, you know, or leave a whole bunch of air in there. Kind of squeeze out some of the air. And you label it, okay? So in about three to five days, you should already see some you know differences this is what your seeds should look like on day four or five when you're done with putting the seeds in the baggies you need to put them in a warm dark place in order for this to work warm dark place in a drawer under a seat cushion just somewhere where it's always warm and always dark and then check on them in about three to four days maybe five days all right hope you enjoyed the video and i'll see you all very soon in another video love you guys bye